Good day, you wonderful people. Here we are, laid out again. What we are making today is the best fritter. Zucchini fritters are the best fritter. And I am going to show you today the most easiest, straightforward zucchini fritters that you can make. These are vegan friendly, delicious, full of flavor, and so easy to whip up. This is gonna be the recipe for you. Try for a quick, easy snack. So I've got myself a rather large zucchini, probably about that long. You know, you want a decent size zucchini. So these sizes, you're probably looking at about that size zucchini. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna grate that up a couple hours before you wanna make these and you're gonna whack a bunch of salt all over that to absorb some of that moisture. And before you start cooking, dab it out with some paper towel to absorb some more moisture as well. You don't want soggy fritters, you want like really, really tasty fritters and that is the way you're gonna do it. The only preparation is to get that moisture out of your zucchini. Really straightforward ingredients, really tasty. As I said, zucchini fritters, probably the best fritters in my opinion. You know, you got corn fritters, which are pretty good. A lot of people bang on about how good potato fritters are, but for me personally, these zucchini fritters are tasty and easy to whip up. I do have a corn fritter recipe as well that I'll have to film as well and show you guys how easy that one is as well. That was one grated zucchini, moisture mostly taken out of that with some salt, dab it out. Don't stress if you can't get all the moisture out, you know, you'll probably get majority of out anyway with just the salt and dabbing. Then we are going to put in our flavorings. So we've got two garlic cloves minced up. I love garlic. Garlic makes the flavor go around. Then we have a teaspoon of baking powder. We are just whacking this all into this bowl right now. And you've got half a cup of plain flour. Then comes your flavoring. So we've got one teaspoon of nutmeg, one tablespoon of sweet paprika. Perfect. Also, to give it a little bit of cheesy flavor, we have vegan crack here. Nutritional yeast gives so much flavor, gives like a cheesy flavor to these as well. You can chuck in probably two, three tablespoons of this stuff. I've just got two tablespoons here. Finally, we have one tablespoon of soy milk. You can use any plant milk that you like. I love my soy milk. This fry pan is currently on. Get some olive oil on there. Now we are going to mix this up. So we've got our fry pan on a medium sort of heat. Better heat on there, ready to fry these fritters. So you want the texture of your fritters, a little bit wet, not overly wet, but if they're too dry, add some more soy milk in there, or if they are too wet, add a little bit more plain flour in there to kind of get that texture right. So you're just gonna roll them up to any size you like. We're gonna whack them onto a hot fry pan. You can hear that sizzle. So you're gonna be cooking it a couple minutes each side, flip them over, and then we are right. So you're gonna press them down as well. So this mixture will probably make about a dozen, depending on the size of your fritters. We've got a couple more cooking in there, but what we'll do, just chuck on some vegan feta. Feta and fritters go together so well. And there we have one delicious set of zucchini fritters. Best fritters in the world. These vegan zucchini fritters are gonna seriously impress you with your flavor. So easy as well. I love an easy recipe and you all love an easy recipe as well. This is full of flavor and highly recommended. 